we need to find course and distance between the two given points so this is point a 2 degree 30 minutes south and 160 degree 30 minute west and we have this point b which is 1 degree 15 minute north and 165 degree 45 minute west so we need to mark these points suppose this is equator which is 0 degree latitude and latitudes are measured 0 to 90 degree north in this direction and 0 to 90 degree south in this direction similarly this assume that this is prime meridian or zero degree longitudes and longitudes are measured zero to 180 degree east or zero to 180 degree west in this direction suppose this is point a and a point a will be in southern hemisphere this is two degree 30 minutes south and this is 160 degree so this meridian will be somewhere like this so this is going to be point a similarly this is one degree 15 minute north say one degree so it is in northern hemisphere and the longitude is 165 which is further west so longitude will be somewhat like this so we have these two points a and b in this direction then this is the distance well this angle is the course and this distance is our d lat so what we can do is we can make another triangle which is this theta the course is measured from this north south line so this is north south line parallel to north south line and this angle is the course this AB is the distance. Both the triangles are similar triangle. However, their orientation is changed. Now we need to find what is D lat difference in latitude between A and B. Since we are moving from A to B like this, what will be our difference in latitude? So this one is one parallel of latitude and this one is another parallel of latitude. The difference in latitude will be the sum of the two and the name is given in the direction of travel. So we are traveling towards north. So we will have D let as uh, 3 degree 45 minute north. Well, this 3 degree we can convert into minutes which is 3 into 60 is equal to 180 plus 45 so we get 225 minute and the direction is towards north similarly let's find what is d long that is difference in longitude between a and b say this is zero degree longitude and longitudes are measured east or west from zero degree longitude so a was 160 and b is 165 the difference in longitude will be the difference between the two and this is 5 degree 15 minute west well the direction of d long will be towards the travel and we can write in minutes as 315 minute west now here let's also find mean lat well mean lat if the latitudes are in different hemisphere that is one in northern hemisphere another in southern hemisphere then mean lat is the difference of the two and which is has to be divided by two the difference has to be divided by two and we name the larger one so here if we go up this is south and this is north so we will have mean let somewhere between the two which is the difference and divide by two and the naming will be the larger one is the south one so the d let will be somewhere here in southern hemisphere so the mean lat will be somewhere here in southern hemisphere because southern latitude is more than the northern latitude we know these formula that departure by d long is equal to cos mean latitude this is the formula for plane sailing so departure is equal to d long into cos mean latitude and we find the departure which is 314.98 minute 
well we use a d long in like this 315 and mean latitude we use this angle cos mean latitude and work out i am using this uh, casio fx 991 ms kelsey and i got this value we also know this formula that 10 theta is equal to departure by d lat well uh, we can verify this that 10 theta will be departure by d lat well this side is d lat and this is departure so departure by d lat will be 10 theta so this will give me the course and the angle will be 054 degree 27.6 let me correct this this angle is theta and the marking of the course is like this suppose this is north south line this is north south line this is east and this is west so we found this angle only theta so actual course in three degree notation will be this one which we can obtain by subtracting 360 degree minus this theta will give me the course so in three degree notation my course will be 305 degree 32.4 minute true and in quadrantal notation i can write the course like this north 54 degree 27.6 west northwest so this course can be written as northwest or in three degree notation i can write also as the 305 degree 32.4 well we need to find distance also distance can be obtained by this formula distance is equal to departure by sine theta because we know that sine theta is sine theta is departure by distance let me go up so here sin theta is departure this is the departure perpendicular by distance and this is hypotenuse so we get distance is equal to departure by sin theta and departure and we need to put the value of theta which was calculated here and we got to be very careful with the angle theta because uh, we need to involve up to this decimal place and i get this distance 2.2 